Hello, fellow rogues and alchemists. Welcome to another episode of Garden of Glass. Flower Fridays, everyone. This is Fate Alchemist. And Sassy Rogue here, and I bet you can see what's going on behind me right here. Uh, some things look looking a little different. And uh, <laughs> I got my necklace back. Heimdale is pleased. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Yep. Yep. If you saw last episode, and you should have... That's right. Yeah, that's and right. And if you haven't, go back and check it out. It's hilarious because Fade makes me his guinea pig. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> but she's right. It is pretty hilarious. <laughs> I'm not going to do that. That stuff's deadly. Anyway. Hey, in, now. In this, epi <laughs> in this episode, one thing we want to work on. Oh, she's escaping. Yep. <laughs> we have a bit of an issue here that's been driving me insane for a long time. A little bit. So we've been we've been doing this to get ores, which is kind of nifty. It's easier than smelting the stone. But if I do this long enough, you're gonna see a problem. There, there it is, is, right on cue. That didn't happen. Yeah, yeah. Not cool, lava. So, Not cool. So one thing that's particularly irritating about that is it's gonna screw up any attempts to automate it. So. Mm -hmm. I have another thought on how we're going to do that, and it's going to involve moving this contraption, using lots of mana, and solving several problems. <laughs> so I'm going to take this down, and I think what we'll do is we're going to create an island somewhere uh, yes. nearby. Oh my gosh, I'm so amazing. I made this traveler's uh, tool belt here, and so now when I shift, and look at my tools! This rod of the depths gives me cobble. Of course, this gives me water. You've seen this before, rod of the seas. And this... My lovely butte rod of the highlands. <laughs> it makes dirt! Anywhere! Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Which will be quite useful for making an island. Yes, and I am uniquely qualified to make this island. This <laughs> is still uniquely qualified. That's right, except really, I am. Because <laughs> so I could do this. <laughs> <laughs> so that's a thing that we're going to do. Yep. <laughs> uh, Sassy truly is a rogue now because she has... A utility belt. Yep. And myself, I got my own means of conveyance. Sassy, I need your eyes. Hold on, this isn't work. There we go. Okay. Like, for example, <laughs> woo! Ha 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 There we go. Bye, Fade. Back down. Hello, Fade. Hello. Boop. Hi. You, that was a very <laughs> gentle landing there. Very gentle landing. Like a leap on the wind. <laughs> That's right, that's right. Oh, Except and you know what? I have, I have plans for this um, uh, spawner as well. I want to make it a giant tree. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. With all my yes. new, like, iridescent um, crystals and stuff, which I don't have in my inventory. Um, all this uh, uh, squid that we've been getting. Oh, geez. So um, let's introduce to you the storage drawers. So this is our very ugly storage drawer. I've been playing with the table over here, which allows yeah. you to combine blocks to <gasps> make Oh, yeah, things. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, hold oh, on, hold oh, on. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, Sassy wants to do this one. <laughs> it's beautiful. Look at it. Ooh. Hold on, I need to set it so I can see it. I want it. Oh, geez. Now I can see it. It's... <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's cool. Oh. Oh. I love it. I'm <laughs> <laughs> going to do this now. And your monocles <laughs> move very strangely. Wanted it there. <laughs> so when I was messing around, I accidentally made these over here, which aren't the prettiest, and now we're stuck with them forever. I oh, jeez. Do any of these matter? <laughs> any of them. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, here, here. Let me let me do this. So we have almost two thousand ink sacks, and I guarantee you. <laughs> when I go down here, so Sassy, I'm going to show the people this thing down here. Okay. So I'm going to be talking for just a second. No problem. We, I'm going to kill these things. Okay. I've cr we've created uh, a little bit of a platform down here, and you can see slime there just jumped off the edge. Oh, that's sad. And uh, always with the ink sacks down here. But on our Slimus, we've made one. And I don't think we'll make the rest floating, because I thought this would make light, but it doesn't. But it is full. That sucker is full. And 
oh man, it's going to be a bit to kind of grind these out, but once we have, I think we decided we'd be able to get nine layers in here. Nine layers with several of these in each layer. I mean, this sucker is just a mana for days. I mean, that's going to solve our mana problems just flat. Yeah. <laughs> okay, these squid are driving me crazy. I, I got to get out of here. Hopefully without them hitting me. So I, I think what we'll do, uh, we were kind of hoping we'd come back and say, hey, done. But it's a bit more of a, a process than what we had initially anticipated. So I think what we'll do instead is we'll pursue something else on camera and we'll slowly chip away at this off camera until it's complete. And when it's Absolutely. done, baby, you can bet we'll give you a tour on it. <laughs> I am going onward, upward and onward. I've taken off everything that I can take off here. Got some food with me and yeah, so, you know. Don't oh. die, sassy. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, <Dave. laughs> Hmm. We are going to need to come over so here. What's, so what sassy is doing here is she's making a stairwell, or stair stairway, or I guess something that we can put stairs on. Mm-hmm. <gasps> Jeez. I'm sorry, when you pass, like, beyond the, like, wall, I mean, this is, like, <laughs> no man's land out here. That makes me nervous. Right. <laughs> oh, boy. All right. Well, you know it's it's fine. It's oh, uh, when I'm you okay. make that, don't don't make it don't make it like a solid uh um like just gradient. Give it some landings here and there. Make it pretty that way. Okay. Cool. It's gonna be pretty. It's gonna be pretty. <laughs> we're going to love it. And we're gonna have landings and stuff. And I am making an island. <laughs> How high should I go? Hmm. Ah, uh, doesn't need to be terribly high. Oops. This is a little bit too early for a landing. Oops. Oh, did oh. you <laughs> accidentally? <laughs> oh, well, I can run on, you know, I'm not going to run on that because you're going to, it's going to disappear and I'm going to die a horrible death and get That's sad. true. You will die a horrible death. I need to get my pickaxe. <laughs> Turns out I do need it. Yep. Yep. Alrighty here. I'm curious. Can I give these things gravity? Hold up. Oh, please don't shoot anything that I'm going to be on. No, no, I won't do that. Yeah, because I could make... <laughs> there it goes. Bye! <laughs> <laughs> it totally does disappear. You'll definitely want to be careful. <laughs> Just say, fade. Yep, you got to be careful with that. Mm. <laughs> Yeah, so you don't like this landing, huh? I think that if you're going to have a landing like that, have it be one lower. I'm just going to go up. All right, I'll let you do your thing. So the reason why we're making this island is that that's where this guy is going to go. It's going to look much different than this because I have a different design in mind that's going to avoid this whole lava problem. Because <laughs> that's a... Uh, Making me unhappy. So yeah, it's not good. <laughs> yeah, it's not good. Unhappy fate is bad. Unhappy fate is bad. Nope. Hey, wait a minute. So <laughs> we are also going to put trees on it, and the idea is since I, these guys are making mana for us so well, I want to figure out a way that we can plant trees automatically and have these guys eat all the time, and hopefully also harvest said trees. So that'll get us wood and mana. And ores. To be amazing. So yeah, that's that's the dream. I have a solution. Yay! Yep. We're gonna go old <laughs> school on this. I'm gonna make sure that lava doesn't decide to just flow through the water. So, gonna gather this up because we're gonna need it here. Sassy is busy making a spark. Yep. And. I'm going to uh, make something that we haven't done just yet. Uh, we need a spark augment. Actually, Sassy, if you could make two sparks. Need two? Okay. Yep. So these spark augments will have the sparks act a little bit differently. The one I'm making right now is going to tell the pool to always try to fill itself and to always stay full. And we don't need a lot. In this pool, we just want enough for a, uh, a redstone mana spare to shoot it out, to shoot out from. 
which reminds me, Sassy will need a redstone mana spreader. <laughs> um, what am I, your workhorse? Hey, I'm making stuff too. <laughs> Let's see. If you make the diluted mana pool, you're going to want to make a mana pool, but use slabs instead. So I will do that here. There we go. There's our diluted mana pool. I have your sparks. There's Sassy. Yeah, I don't have room for that. Okay, cool. There's five sand. You're going to need that. <laughs> yeah, you got the sparks, all right. All right, hit me. What this give me the sparks? Thank you. They just go right to you. Yep, I got the <laughs> magnet ring on. Yep, Sassy that's made nice. Me, uh, what am I supposed jewelry. to make? A pulse mana spreader. All you need to do is take a mana spreader and put it in the crafting grid with a piece of redstone. Okay. That is all we need. Cool. And once you have that, join me upstairs. I'm going to start building this thing. Kind of did this in my head real quick, and I think it's going to work. So, <laughs> you don't even need the steps. Nope. <laughs> Do this. All right. Pretty. Here's the pulse mana spreader. Fantastic. Just toss it in me. Yep. You're welcome. There. We'll have all of this be glass. Ooh, pretty mana glass. And the water. Gotta make this one taller, I think. Go. The water is <laughs> to sit right there, so we're going to put there, there. You know, jittery. Mm -hmm. My there wand. No. Oh. Weird. Okay, there we go. So we want the lava to be hitting this. And on this side is where we want that pulse mana spreader. Sassy, uh, you gave it to me. Good. Okay. Yes, I did. I was going to make a mess. It didn't. Weird. <laughs> I'll take it. All right. And the smooth stone is going to land here. There we go. What you'll want to do is make sure that we got this rod set so you can point this pulse mana spreader at the stone. We're going to punch out the back block here. And we're going to put our diluted mana pool right there. Then what we need to do we might actually have to move that pulse because I forgot a step here. We need we need the spark. We're gonna pop it on there. Spark. Pop it on there. There we go. And now we'll put that pulse mass spreader back and rebind it to our stone. There we go. Okay. So now any mana that's in a mana pool that has a spark on it is just going to automatically get drawn into this pool, which will allow this thing to be able to shoot. This stone, which will cause it to drop. And the dropper. And underneath. Perfect. <laughs> All right, drop them on my face. That's funny. <laughs> All right, there we go. So place it on top. All right. And now we need to get the lava bucket in here. Perfect. <laughs> and let's see how this is looking. Ugh. <laughs> it's, um, <laughs> fade, it's beautiful. No, it's not. <laughs> and uh yeah this is now done uh with the exception of one little thing we no longer need the lens on my uh mana blaster we're gonna put it on the uh pulse mana spreader instead so now every time it shoots it'll get that weighted ability on the count 
uh, we're going to do this at the same time, okay? You want to click the hourglass with the sand, with that pile. So, right one, click. yes, one, two, three. Did you do it? Yep. It's working. It's kind of cool. There we go. Mm -hmm. So lava will get in there. Okay, now it's not going to actually do anything yet because we haven't put mana in this. So I need to put mana in here. We're going to let it feed from my ring for now. <laughs> All right. Check it out. <laughs> oh, see? It did the stupid, but it's fixed itself because I'm smart. <laughs> Take that, Good you job, dumb man. glitchy thing. <laughs> uh, and there we go. Demonstrate for you. Oh, I'm so glad it did that because it, it perfectly demonstrates why I made it this way instead. Right. Now, this looks really cool. Yeah. We might want to adjust the time. I think it's a bit slow. We might want three sand in each, I think. Yeah. Okay. But, um, well, see what it does is every sand counts as a second in the hourglass. And whenever they flip, it makes a redstone signal. I see. And so that's what's powering the dispenser. Sucks lava back in, so it resets. Oh, so I see that machine's pretty awesome, though, uh, isn't it? Oh, yeah, it's pretty cool. It'll allow us to do other things, that's for sure. Kind of loud, though. I would say so. Yeah. Too bad we don't have anything like the wool that we use to muffle the uh, spreaders. It's funny you should ask. So, there's something I can make called a ceiling oak. I need a clown sapling. Sapla. You're in the mana pool. Dude, that's not sanitary. It's fine. Can I have the wool? There it is. You're like, your feet, and, and plus it's got that, like, blood <laughs> dribble thing in there. <laughs> Are you okay? It's, um, my feet have never been cleaner. I bet they haven't. <laughs> <laughs> Magical foot wash. So, Sassy, um, this is our new tree. Ooh. And are you ready for me to give it the, uh, Fade magic touch. Coming up. Okay, I'm right. ready. All right. Da 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 da. <laughs> so that looks like your white tree, doesn't it? <laughs> it does. I want That's... some of the leaves. All right. Now, oh, it's so quiet. Notice how there's no sound over here. Isn't. I've got some sap lies. Cool. I'm. I'm. I'll let you. Uh, oh. I'm going. I'm not going to break that. Made out of wool. It's a. Uh, Dampening oak. Basically, every block from this can be used to stampen sound. I think even the uh, leaves can. Ooh, we only you actually can got make ceiling oak planks too. Yeah, yeah. In fact, that's probably better use of it because you I get have more. four saplings. Nice. Ah, that sounds better. So right now, this isn't making any sound at all. We found while making this sassy and I that the more the ceiling oak you use, the more it mutes the sound. So we just put like bars of leaves behind it here. And put some uh, wood inside the uh, frame and it's uh, it's nice and quiet. Since making trees is so much fun, we're going to do it again. There we go. Soul roots. I like them too. I'm going to need more. Yeah. And we can combine it with my new plant magic. Circuit tree. This thing looks crazy. I love this tree already. I love it already. Ready to check it out, Sassy? Ready. Bam. Ooh, pretty. Oh, oh that grew ooh. fast. Ooh, ooh. Whoa. You're not allowed to do anything until I take some of these. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy looking. What's that look like when you cut it, I wonder? Ooh, that's really bright red. I wonder what that looks like when you, uh... Oh, sassy, look at those. Awesome, I love it. Oh, wow. Cool. Ooh, boy. I got some of those leaves here, by the way. Cool, and I have a sapling. Nice. What those do, guys, is, um... For each block in the tree, it will make a um, a signal of equal that strength. So you can like uh, modulate how strong of a signal you send out from the tree. That's a redstone source. 
There might be somebody who can use to take advantage of that when we're making stuff. Oh my gosh! I have a tool belt! Look! Oh, it's cute. You got like all these elementium tools in it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I have a tool belt! <laughs> you do. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> it looks good on you. <laughs> yeah! I look like proper smart here. This is great. You're the rogue. You got all the tools. I got my tools. I got my tools. Woo! Oh. <laughs> Salute! <laughs> well, fellow rogues and alchemists, we're going to call that an episode for today for Garden of Glass. We got the very silent working machine of ores behind us. And it's amazing oh. and soft and quiet, and I, I I, do like that feature about it, that's for sure. <laughs> I love it because it looks magical. <laughs> if you like what you saw, please smack that like button, subscribe. It really helps out our channel. And make sure you check out us out on Twitter at roguealchemist underscore. And you know what? I will see you all in the next episode. <laughs> bye, everybody. Bye. Is that bad? No, 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 no. You're fine. I'm and on I think you've just it. been hit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean Are those things I said. No. Yes. <laughs>